<laughs> when you were laughing at that, is it because we have such extreme makeup? <laughs> Yeah, you, you look like classic teenagers. Yeah, we do. <laughs> why, um, why did you start <coughs> taking Polaroid pictures? Um, instant gratification, isn't it? Um, <laughs> I don't know, it was the age, it was the age of digital cameras and just moving into like iPhones and that sort of grainy, camera you could have in your pocket um, and I had a digital camera at some point um, but I don't know it's just not as different to have a Polaroid because you got the one you got to only got one shot to make it count <laughs> you might never make that moment again um, so it's nice and then you like have the physical object I think it's pretty kind of universal that people like Polaroids for the same reason mm. so who's in that um, this is my older sister in her first uni room in Manchester, 2016. Um, she decorated really nicely, actually. Fair play to her. Yeah. Um, this is very dull, this picture of this house. Oh, yeah. But I thought it looked nice. My friend's Lego stuff in her house. <laughs> thought it looked nice. Zoe in Paris. Aww. Dylan and Snowy, again. Yeah, it is a running theme. I reckon there's so many of him because he's been my friend for so long. That's Dylan and Snowy after watching Bride and Prejudice. <laughs> I don't know when we did that. Uh, this was the last day of school with all our signed t-shirts. These, That's nice. These two are Zoe mm -hmm. uh, in my two childhood bedrooms. Aww. One's 2013 and one's 2015. It's actually crazy how much older she looks. Yeah. Only a year has passed. A year and three months. Oh, wow, yeah. Hang on. Oh, look at this one! <laughs> what is that? Oh my god, the it's Yvette, Susie, David and Curly on Susie's B-Day. 2020. <laughs> oh my god, that's three years ago. That's nuts. Nutty! Oh, 